Over the last year, the explosion of growth within the NFT industry has paved the way for numerous exciting new projects to come to life. Many of these projects offer a compelling investment opportunity for savvy investors who have the foresight to identify them early in their lifespan. To help clarify the investment landscape, this video will discuss the best new NFT projects this year, covering the top upcoming NFTs before highlighting where to invest in these assets today with no transaction fees. So watch this video all the way through to the end so you don't miss out on anything. Hi, Cryptopreneurs. What is your favorite crypto? Let us know in the comments. If you like making crazy money with crypto, this is the place for you. Here we explore new gems and explain the best new tiny undervalued cryptos with 100x or 1000x potential. You will also find all the news of the crypto space every day. So, make sure to subscribe and activate notifications for all the upcoming videos. Follow us on our social channels and join as members for added perks. Now without further ado, let's get straight to the point. Goblin Town WTF. Your first NFT collection is going to be Goblin Town NFT. It's done this without hype, a roadmap, or a huge following, while the NFTs were distributed for free. All they have is a Twitter account with 10,600 followers and counting. Built on the Ethereum blockchain, Goblin Town is a 10,000 strong collection of generative NFTs that launched on the 22nd of May. A Twitter profile for the project was set up only this month, and the team behind the collection has made a point of not revealing itself. There is no roadmap with details about where the project is headed, and there is no Discord where the team can communicate with its community. Finally, the Goblin Town developer stated explicitly that there is no utility attached to the NFTs. By design, we don't know a huge amount about Goblin Town. The collection seems to have come from nowhere and has not been heavily marketed to the NFT community. Despite this, the trading volume for the NFTs on OpenSea is already over 3,800 ETH. They've come up with an effective way of standing out in an industry whose users claim to appreciate solid smart contracts, clear roadmaps, and a team that communicates clearly and valuable utilities. What we're seeing is that people crave novelty. They want to associate themselves with a brand new NFT concept because this will, in turn, make the holder of the NFT stand out. It seems that the short-term goal is to troll everyone who thinks bored apes, mutant apes, moonbirds, clone X, and invisible friends are serious collections. Upending preconceptions about blue chip NFTs seems to be Goblin Town's method for differentiating itself from the sometimes smug projects that trade on their own exclusivity. Looking at the Goblin Town website, it's obviously creative and despite the seeming lack of care, a lot of thought has clearly gone into it. But the anonymous team behind the project hasn't spent its time building up a loyal fanbase and a strong community. And the NFTs were minted for free, so there's nothing to undercut by breaking the floor price. In a way, Goblin Town is the anti-NFT project. It's the punk rock of Web3 and its quick success is a testament to its originality. If this popularity continues, expect a slew of copycat projects that feign indifference and attempt to make a virtue out of apathy. Number 2. Elftown.wtf So, the next project we're going to see here is Elftown. The Dark Elves and High Elves, the two ancient races of Karis, have put aside their differences to conquer the greatest evil our land has ever faced, the Goblin Hordes. That's the theme of their project. And apparently, it's some kind of Goblin Town spin-off. Actually, we're not entirely sure. This is because of their WTF ending. Just like the previous project, this collection seems to be a bit lacking in real work. The drawings are low quality, but it feels like a quick drawing of a little elf. Their website, it's a very basic one where they're just like dark elves and high elves to races. It's kind of like elves versus goblins. So maybe they're just trying to create an opportunity to create an elf versus goblins kind of story. But when you look at the site itself, what it's built on, it's on squarespace.com. So they just took a picture of the asset, put the connect portfolio button there, and yeah, that's pretty much what it is, so hard to say. This project is going to go far because, again, you don't know anything about this project. So when you do go to their Twitter, there isn't much going on. It's just if it's the same people who did Goblin Town, that means they probably know what they're doing. And obviously, it could be them because several indicators show that. Number 3. Wrecked Guy The third collection we're going to see in this video is going to be Wrecked Guy. 
In a nutshell, a Wrecked Guy NFT is a collection of images of Wrecked Guy. For now, the project hasn't released much information. According to its website, Wrecked Guy is art and PFPs and stuff. Well, okay, so what about the utility and roadmap? No, wait, LOL is the project's answer to utility and roadmap. While there isn't much to go on, let's take a look into what we know so far. Firstly, the Wrecked Guy NFT collection is based on the Wrecked Guy corrector. A misspelling of Wrecked denotes an NFT or crypto trader who is devastated by a recent price crash. To be honest, in the current market conditions, that amply describes a lot of traders. The artwork in itself represents this, a hooded skeleton drinking to cope with the current situation. This might sound familiar to a lot of crypto or NFT traders. Days back, NFT whale Kozomode Medici and Snoop Dogg bought a wrecked guy NFT each, sending the project sales flying. The collection by acclaimed artist OSF is currently the second top NFT collection by 24 hour volume on OpenSea. The free to mint NFT collections floor is already climbing upwards of 0.85 ETH, all within less than two weeks of its drop. Now that the official mint period is over, your best chance to get a wrecked guy NFT is on the secondary market. For this, simply head over to either OpenSea or LooksRare, the two leading NFT marketplaces in the space. But remember the golden rule, always buy from verified collections on the marketplaces. Currently, the cheapest wrecked guy NFT will cost you about $1600. The rarer NFTs in the collection will, of course, cost much higher. Some top NFTs in the collection have sold for as high as 20 Ethereum or about $38,000 at current prices. But as always, before leaping, do your own research. The next project we will see today is called Admit1. Admit1 is a collection of 1000 access NFTs created by Gmoney NFT. Admit1 NFTs work as an entry ticket to an exclusive community of Web3 enthusiasts, builders, and thought leaders. Gmoney rewarded its supporters that held any Gmoney POAPs with the ability to mint an Admit1 NFT for no cost. Additionally, Gmoney is launching a zero-fee marketplace for all collections related to the Gmoney brand. A community-focused marketplace allows people to trade any Gmoney NFT without the worry of being scammed by fake collections, along with curating the purchasing experience. Holding an Admit1 NFT allows holders to be in the center of all Gmoney projects. The floor on Admit1 is 11 Ethereum. Something tells us this will be the lowest price you'll be able to pick one of these up for, ever, but we don't have a crystal ball, so don't take our word for it. That being said, it's projects like this that often start with one NFT and then provide countless new benefits and additional NFTs to their holders. With only a thousand Admit1 NFTs, this is going to be a very small community that is likely to get some very special things as the journey unfolds. We haven't been this excited about a new drop in a very, very long time. This is just great. We hope we were able to provide some value and helped you to move a step ahead in your crypto journey. Be sure to check out our crypto brand called Cryptopreneur. Get yourself the highest quality crypto merch available right now on the market and make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss out on any of our content. Till next time, goodbye.